Well, this weekend may have you focused on a little cultural history. Live at Five's Marcus Powers joins us now with the weekend preview and we'll get a little culture going for us. Yes, well, I first want to say that it's a two, two very important days in Beaumont today. First off, it's Kelly Phillips Day. <laughs> I don't know if everybody knew that, but it is Kelly Phillips Day. And the other thing is, in, in all seriousness, it is the third birthday of Cat 5 Magazine, which I think is something that yes, it is, is. we're all very appreciative of. They've done a great job of kind of bringing things like that we talk about here on Weekend Preview, bring them to the forefront, and they, they kind of started it all. So yes. good for them. And speaking of that, first Thursday is tonight. And I think, you're, as you are mentioning, at the end of it all, at 9 o'clock, is the um, Symphony of Southeast Texas after, is it after Dark. Yes. After Dark is what it's called. And they have one this month and next month on first Thursday, which I think is March 6th as well, I think. Anyway, it's $15, Roth Recital Hall. They've got, um, it's not the full symphony, I think. It's just like a, like a quartet or quintet, but just string instruments. And then afterwards, I got a wine and dessert reception, which is kind of cool. And then um, first Thursday is obviously, there's also stuff at, um, at Tacos Obama. They have a couple's burrito eating contest. And, you know, all up and down the regular stuff, Catherine Company, all that. Right. And then at the end of the night, Cat 5 is having a third birthday party at Luke's with some Fun. special drinks and everything there. So you can go there and celebrate their contribution to Southeast Texas. So yeah. That will be a lot of fun. Exactly. And then on Saturday is the uh, Sacred Places Tour in Galveston. Mm -hmm. um, if you've been to Galveston, you know they've got a lot of um, churches there. Right. And I think there's uh, eight churches on the tour. It's $15. Um, GalvestonMerchants.com, you can get tickets ahead of time. All starts at St. Joseph Church, which is on uh, 2202 Avenue K. I don't know where that is, but you can Google it. Um, and uh, it's from uh, 10 to 4 Saturday. Like I said, tickets $15, and all the proceeds go to the Galveston Historical Foundation, which is working actually to um, restore that church, the St. Joseph Church. So, um, you know, all your money goes to a good, good thing there. And also on Saturday at 10 o'clock in the morning, Dishman Art Gallery, there's a thing called Empty Bowls Bowl Making Marathon, which is um, Empty Bowls is kind of a movement where they it's tried to eradicate hunger. All the funds from that go to the Southeast Texas Food Bank, which is um, which you know is a great foundation you can give to, and it's completely free. But they give all the bowls they're making are gonna are gonna be auctioned basically um, to. Um, I'm not sure where they're going to be auctioned somewhere, and all those funds will go to the Southeast Texas Food Bank. And um, apparently, I mm -hmm. don't know anything about about um, making bowls, but apparently they're going to have people from Lamar there that that help out, and at all uh, everyone is welcome at all levels, including me, who is completely novice. So, <laughs> and uh, you can make a bowl. You can make a bowl, have it auctioned off, and help people help eradicate hunger in Southeast Texas. Sounds wonderful. Yeah, so fun and good. Exactly. Yeah. A little culture for you exactly. this weekend. That should be, yeah, exactly. All the way around. Exa all the way around. All right, Marcus, thanks. As always, we do it every Thursday. It's the Weekend Preview. Yeah.